stop the FOMO. Do you have a fear of missing out on side-by-side -side comparisons between the LG G3 and the Samsung S95C? Because you still need help deciding which $3,300 OLED TV to buy. Good news. In this video, we will compare them side-by-side -side in the three most popular picture modes that most of you will be using. First is standard mode for watching YouTube and news, where settings are at a reasonably bright but color-pleasant mode. Then there's accurate filmmaker mode. These settings are most accurate for HDR content. And lastly is full blast brightness sports mode, where both TVs are in their brightest possible mode, LG in vivid mode and the S95C in dynamic mode. Best for sports like hockey or football in a bright room. Today's sponsor is Hua Nuo and its super affordable dual monitor stand for creators, streamers, gamers, and home office enthusiasts. It can hold two monitors between 13 inches and 35 inches per arm. Perfect for large widescreen and vertical displays as you see here in my live stream setup. Yes, you can even rotate the screen to a vertical orientation. Reinforced for maximum strength and stability, it can hold between 4.4 and 26.4 pounds. But why would I need a weight capacity of 26 pounds? Because I like installing me some accessories. By using this monitor shelf mount, sold separately, attached to the dual monitor stand, I can secure my Sony FX30 mirrorless camera plus lighting accessories for best-in-class YouTube live streaming. Or with a laptop holder, also sold separately, you can lift both your laptop and monitor stand off the desk. Perfect for taller people. Huan Huo's dual monitor arms can extend up to 25 and a half inches and elevate up to 21 inches. With full motion rotation, you are only limited by your creativity. Best of all, with this easy clamp mounting system, I had it securely mounted to my standing desk in five minutes. Priced way, way lower than its competitors, the Huan Huo dual monitor stand is the affordable, high quality option for the discerning consumer. Check it out by clicking on the link in my video description below. Now, neither are calibrated out of the box, so there are minor color differences between the two. For example, on the G3, in white scenes, you'll notice a slight green push. On the S95 Slee, it's a touch of red. Regardless of these minor differences, skin tones still look natural in the movie scenes that you'll see. However, the LG G3 did have a little trouble in Monster Hunter, specifically the dark scene with the strobing light. Now, let's get to it. Beginning with YouTube content in standard mode.
Let's go. Yeah, I was building on the lecture. Versus coming daily under pressure. Working on the plot and the scheme. The true stock trademark is at the edge of your dreams. I'm talking one. One shot for the kill. The breeze cut freeze up. Straight drop in the chills. I'm talking. Taking over pieces and shares. A bomb with the sky high. Check the movement is here. Yeah. yeah. It's one heart, one shot. Now the future is yours. Go. Turning dreams into reality In the lab with the formula and chemistry The memories spark and motivate And make the industry shake We put the bars in the brakes I'm talking one now it's HDR movies in filmmaker mode. Using my Kaleidoscape movie server, I put together a script of scenes for you guys to go over the various HDR content. Different scenes reflect the different advantages of each TV. The G3 is able to hit white specular highlights a touch brighter than the S95C. Whereas the S95C, you'll notice when there's bright color, sometimes it hits it a little bit harder. This scene is interesting because bright light is reflecting off his face. The S95C appears to have a touch more saturation. Whether or not it's accurate is a different question. And in this monster hunter scene is where the G3 has problems. A combination of color banding and loss of color saturation. And with that pulsing light, it's really obvious. Now, this is not a common occurrence because these type of scenes are rare. And finally, sports content in the brightest modes for each TV. Vivid on the G3 and dynamic on the S95C. It's a lot of look this damn good. Cause baby, I feel real good and I wish I would. It's gotta be against the law to look this damn good. Everybody watch out. Watch out now. I'm ready for a good time. And I came to groove. The whole band's here and we came to move. Got a fresh haircut and two new shoes. We're here all night like we got nothing to lose. For more reviews and side-by-side -side comparisons, check my videos here and here. Until next time, stop the FOMO.